What is up YouTube, John here and you're watching Spotlight and this is the new AirPods unboxing so let's get to it. These AirPods are the ones with the regular charging case, not the wireless charging case. To be completely frank with you, I think it's totally worth saving 40 bucks if you're buying the ones without the wireless charging case. I mean, these ones cost $159 plus tax and the other ones cost $199. So 40 bucks just for wireless charging? Uh, no, thank you. I think you should keep the money. Anyway, so this is the packaging. I just wanna show you the box here. I like this Apple, it's really cool, silver and shiny. And uh, you have the same shimmer on the AirPods word. Really nice, very Apple-like design for the box. This is the back of the box, AirPods with charging case. Okay, sweet. So the box design is very Apple-like. It's very in line with Apple's design language. And these protruding pictures of the AirPods are pretty awesome too. Now what's not Apple-like in this packaging is the plastic wrapping. Now, so what's cool about plastic wrapping around the newer iPhone boxes is that they have this little plastic tab that you can just pull and then you just unwrap the plastic off the package. This doesn't have that, as you can see, the plastic is just sealed tight all around, so uh, you'd have to peel the plastic off uh, in, in the old-fashioned way. Now, I know that's a small thing to mention, but this is an Apple product. You expect the best user experience, and the plastic wrapping part here is not the best. But anyway, so I have this knife handy here, so I'm gonna go ahead and start working on this. I really don't want to hurt the box. Where do I start? Okay. Okay, I think I'm in. Yep, I'm in. Sweet. And here it is, guys. Nice. Elegant, simple, beautiful. Simply beautiful. Okay, this lid comes off easily. This lid comes off easily and that's nice. Like if you guys remember older iPhones, I think the box struggled a bit to come off, but this, I just took it off slowly, but it's not hard to take off. So I mean, so I'm just putting it back on here and let's see. Not too bad, not too bad designed by Apple in California. You're just gonna have your usual paperwork in here. I just love the layout. I love the simplistic look. It's something that I really love about Apple products. Let's see what we've got here. AirPods, okay. Turn on Bluetooth. Shows you all the other devices that your AirPods can work with, so it's not just your iPhone. Also works with watchOS, iOS, and macOS. Sweet. More paperwork, safety and handling. Uh, okay. Apple one year limited warranty, awesome. Okay, so here we are. This is the paperwork. Of course, the, uh, the iconic phrase designed by Apple in California, awesome. This, of course, is very Apple-like. Beautiful, beautiful. I think this is gonna be a real smooth unwrapping experience. And here we are. 
Here it is, guys. Designed by Apple in California, assembled in China. And this is it. This is the case. Beautiful curves, beautiful design. Typical Apple elegance. That's a beautiful snap. And you may realize that some of my comments apply to the older AirPods as well as these newer AirPods, but I'm just commenting about the product in general. So, let's take these out. See the little uh, blinking light? Okay. Take this one out. It's just a... Uh, Turns green. Let's just uh, set this. Well, okay. Just set it here. And here they are, guys. Okay, so here they are. Okay, now aside from the packaging and, and the case and all that stuff, here is my issue with these. I don't think this is the best design and I'll tell you why. Uh, first of all, they look, and you may have heard this before, they just look uh, to a large degree, not completely, but to a large extent, like the regular ear pods with the wires just snatched out. So there's something flawed, in my opinion, about the design of these arms on the AirPods. Now, they don't look quite right. Now, I'm not saying that the design is not purposeful, it probably is, but what I'm saying is it's not as appealing and it just looks like something's off about them. It did when the first AirPods came out, it still does with these because, you know, the design is pretty much the same. Now, if you compare them to the AirPods, you'll notice that the arms are thicker and uh, of course, there are other different features, uh, but but uh, generally speaking, uh, the one obviously big difference is you don't have to deal with this. You don't have to do this to yourself anymore. You know, I actually arranged it before I recorded, so it's not really tangled up. But this can get really bad, as you all know. So obviously, clearly, the AirPods are going to provide a better user experience than uh, having the wire tangled up every while. Another issue that you're going to avoid completely with the AirPods is that you're not going to have the problem when you plug in your EarPods with the lightning connector and be on a phone call and have the other person not be able to hear you from the microphone on the wire because for some reason it isn't working. So with these, you shouldn't have that issue with voice pickup on the call. Now, one big flaw with the AirPods and with the EarPods is for some people like myself, this shape earphone does not work in my ear uh, when i say it doesn't work i mean it fits and everything it just kind of falls out pretty easily so for example if i'm on a treadmill if uh, if i want to say jog or something or pick up the pace or do something that involves quite a bit of activity uh, there is a chance that these would fall out of my ears i wish airpods and the earpods for that matter came with a rubber attachment that would cover up the earpieces so that they would fit more snugly into your ear and kind of stay jammed in there and not fall out. So this, I would anticipate is gonna be an issue with the AirPods because it's an issue with my AirPods. Another issue with AirPods, and this, in this case, the pro is the con as well, is that because they don't have any wires, like if you had AirPods in and one of the earphones fell out of your ear, the wire can prevent the whole thing from falling on the ground. And you can still just grab the wire and pull the AirPods up so they don't fall on the floor or something. With AirPods, there is no wire, so if it falls out of your ear, it falls out of your ear, and these aren't cheap. Other than that, obviously, the AirPods are a nice idea, 
the user experience is just gonna be cleaner in a way because of the lack of tangling of a wire and whatnot. Now to get the cable out of the box, so here we are. Here's the cable. Nicely wrapped. Here it is. Pretty standard. Now there's something else I want to show you guys. So here's the case. And here's some dental floss. This is the size comparison. So lengthwise, the AirPods case and the dental floss pack are really, really close. Widthwise, the AirPods case is a bit wider. And thickness-wise, the AirPods case is a bit thicker. But then again, we're comparing this with a pack of floss. So <laughs> this is awesome, awesome size. So that's it for this video guys, if you liked it, please watch my other videos, subscribe to the channel, give this video a thumbs up and comment down below and all that good stuff. Thanks for watching and see you next time.